More than 3,000 Hutu prisoners are being held in crowded conditions at the Kigali prison. They claim that government troops who control the jail have taken prisoners away and shot them. Many say that before being locked up, they were tortured, beaten and hit with machetes. The army denies the accusations. The government has also rejected a UN report prepared by a consultant claiming that 30,000 Hutus have been massacred seeking retribution for atrocities against Tutsis. The report is baseless and I think it, is, uh, it has been done by an individual who did not consult anybody, especially authorities here in this country. The government admits that some retaliatory killings have been committed, possibly by its troops, but it maintains the cases were isolated. At a national rally in Kigali, government and military leaders appealed to troops and civilians to maintain peace and security in Rwanda and not to seek revenge. They want to reassure Hutu refugees that it is safe to return home. But with Hutu militants reported to be maintaining their power base in the refugee camps by spreading fear of Tutsi atrocities, that message from Kigali seems unlikely to get through.